वेलकम बैक एवरी वन गुड आफ्टरनून अवर टूडेज टॉपिक इज दैट इज एस टी एम एल मार्कअप मैथड्स वट इज एक्स एस टी एम एल मार्कअप मैथड्स डेट आर यूज बाई जाबा स्क्रिप्ट यू कैन सी दैट एंकर ब्लिंक फिक्स स्ट्राइक सबस्क्रिप्ट एंड सुपर स्क्रिप्ट दीज आर दम एस टी एम एल मार्कअप मैथड डेट आर अडोप्टेड बाय अ जावा स्क्रिप्ट मैथड इन प्रीवियस टॉपिक वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट वेरियस सर्चिंग मैथड ऑल दिस बाई जावा स्क्रिप्ट एंड बिफोर दैट आफ्टर दैट वी डिस्कस अबाउट सबस्ट्रिंग and uh, uh, split text uh, evaluation with the help of javascript objects so today we will discuss about xtml markup method see what is happening here first of all you can see this example in this example you can see this window uh, first is this is the anchor tag this is a blink tag this is a uh, mono expected text then next word is a, this is strike oc text this is text with the subscript and actually the superscript how this will be generated with the help of a uh, function of javascript we can use a function of javascript to generate this one and these function are called a object of javascript see first object is that is anchor a anchor tag is created by simple we use a anchor tag like a and name of this anchor tag like top and we specify the anchor here message here ki we are to uh, provide a link to in this example we use a on page anchor tag and next is that is blink tag where a text to be blinking for for some time we need a text on our web page that is blink on and off at uh, uh, a certain interval that is we use a blink tag blink and then heading like blink and we can use this tag for this and fixed is a monospace text monospace text we use with the help of tt tag tt tag is used here to specify a monospace text uh, at your screen with the help of fixed this is also called a fixed text also and a strike of tag we will strike out the text by using a strike tag we can write strike and strike out text is display here here we want center line uh, uh, strike by with the help of a line on the center position and we use a subscript tag that is use a sub tag is here sub tag is used for subscripting and sub tag is used for superscripting I mean these are the simple tags that are available for us but we have to build an application or a web page that are using a javascript object with the help of javascript we can use these tag or we can operate these tags see with the help of example in this example you can see we can uh, we use a scripting tag here again a scripting tag with name a javascript a simple html is a building here and our title we use uh, xtml markup method or string object we simply uh, titleize this uh, web page and in script tag a text of javascripting is used here we use uh, some variables you can see for first variable is that is anchor text second variable is blink text third one is fixed text link text strike text sub text and super text in these variable we specify some string that is we have to be uh, generate with the help of html stringing you can see a first variable is anchor text here we write this is anchor a message is here we can simply write this is anchor that is a string type automatically created a string type anchor text and second one is blink text here we uh, write it this is blink text this text all text will be blinked out so with the help of comma we separated these variables we can also write like this one we in uh, javascript by to declare a variable by uh, uh, with the differentiating of uh, comma operator and after last at we use a semicolon here to describe that okay, this is our ending and where these variables are be created here we use 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 Total variables of seven total strings variable that are already discussed. So our main task is to use a JavaScript object. How we use JavaScript object here? You can see here a document dot write line is used here in this document. We can say that in document, what is document? Document is is a window that is our body window is called a document window. In this document window, we can write a line. Write line is used for write line. We write a anchor text. we call a anchor text what is anchor text anchor text is a variable this variable is we called here anchor text dot anchor here we use a javascript object object name is anchor please stress on this a javascript object is anchor whose name is top we can specify the name to javascript object anchor that is tab means um, we in one window we can use more than one anchor tag but you have to just write a anchor keyword with the help of different name you can say top before that we, uh, we uh, if we don't use a javascript object 
so we can simply write like this one a name top and anchor but this is a altern uh, this is a, a standard wave in html but with the help of javascript methodology this is the an alternative way to create a anchor tag at runtime a scripting tag is here a object is used that is anchor object see the differentiation so in next line we can write a document dot write line a break tag is embedded with concatenation operation and like we, we call blink text what is blink text this one this is variable is called ki this text the text between this blink text variable dot blink here we use a javascript object or a method name is blink so with the help of this blink uh, method this text will be blinked out in our output window and same as for our document dot right hand for monospaced monospace we use a fixed word where we use a fixed text a fixed text is a this one and this dot fixed means we use a javascript object here that is fixed so you can note it down fixed keyword is used fixed is a again a method of a javascript object that is already a built in and next is we use a strike strike is also used for strike out means these three functionalities if we write in a simple html coding we use a blink tag we use a tt tag for monospace we use strike tag for this strike purpose but in javascript we use for anchor tag we use a anchor object for blink we use a blink object for fixed we use a fixed object for strike we use a strike object means for each and every application we have a different object there so let's discuss about how we get uh, uh, to define a superscript and subscript here for defining a superscript and subscript you can write a, again a document dot write line be a tag this is text with a this text is specified in this text a is superscript or subscript text is we have to define we have to use a subtext what is subtext subtext is a variable which contain a superscript or a sub uh, subtext is a superscript with two uh, strings are uh, character values are there you can see here in this we will write a sub a sub is again a javascript object javascript object that is used for subscripting a text and next one is that is sub that is used for subscripting a text I mean both are same so that are using a subscript and superscript you can see here in output window this is a text with a a subscript is write by this subscript and superscript is write by this superscript and document dot write line when last line we write a click here to go to the anchor text oh, mean we use the anchor text with name top if we want to move to this position we can simply write a link text dot link a link text is a what is a link text link text is a text that is written here a link text simple text is written here so we call this text here link text dot link at where hash top you can see here we use a link text simple text is here that is click here to go to a anchor text this text is embedded here link text dot link we specify a link again what is link link is again a javascript object that is to link to a specific uh, anchor tag or here we can also specify html links also html like we http link also sorry HTTP links like we have to specify HTTP colon slash s like www.google.com we have specified here also but here we use a on inline or on sheet uh, uh, linking with the help of anchor tag we use a top but the name of the top is hash top we specify and a top name of first anchor tag that is used between them so this is a basic application that is adopted by HTML markup methods hope so you all enjoy it if you have any query any doubt you can comment me out or again you can whatsapp me personally on my whatsapp number and this is all about uh, html markup method and javascript methods so this is a, a how, and i will show you uh, i also show you the difference between them ki how we use a simple html or how we use a javascript object methods or objects for, to identify these uh, html simple methods thank you guys hope so you enjoy it have a nice day Thank you.